Your morning news now. Congressional investigators are now looking into why President Trump didn't stop the mob on January 6th as it attacked the U.S. Capitol last year. The House panel is asking to speak to Ivanka Trump. She's one of the people who asked her father to call off rioters that day. U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken is meeting with his Russian counterpart in Geneva today. This comes as Russia-Ukraine tensions are high due to the ongoing presence of Russian troops at the Ukrainian border. The U.S. is accusing Russia of recruiting officials in an attempt to take over Ukrainian government. Blinken is reiterating there will be a heavy price to pay by Russia if there is any further aggressive action towards Ukraine. Officials in the San Francisco Bay Area say they are seeing signs the latest COVID surge is starting to plateau there. But new daily cases in the U.S. continue to test the limits of many hospitals around the nation, some of which are now receiving help from members of the military. Breaking overnight meatloaf, the iconic, larger-than-life singer and performer, has died. According to his verified Facebook page, Marvin Lee Aday died with his wife Deborah by his side. His 1977 record, Bad Out of Hell, was one of the best-selling albums of all time. Some of his hits included I'll Do Anything for Love and Paradise by the Dashboard Lights. No cause of death was shared on his social media. The singer was 74 years old. Mostly clear skies uh, this morning with temperatures around minus 10. We will be looking at uh, those sunny conditions continuing through the early noon with temperatures around 9. Increasing clouds this afternoon with highs today expected to be around 16. We will soon know more about the new plans for the former Kmart site on La Crosse's south side. 360 Real Estate will hold a public engagement meeting at 530 next Wednesday at Central High School. There is also an option to join virtually. Kmart closed its doors in 2017. U-Haul started moving into the building in January of last year, then moved out in March following a lack of support from city leaders and residents. Safety improvements are planned for a state highway in Monroe County. Wisconsin DOT is asking for comments about plans to recondition a 15-mile stretch of Wisconsin Highway 27. The goal is to decrease the frequency and severity of crashes. Improvements include increasing paved shoulder width from 3 to 6 feet and adding center line and shoulder rumble strips. Work is expected to begin next year. And starting today, winter fun can be found in downtown La Crosse. Downtown Main Street's Winter Days event start at locations throughout the city's downtown. Special deals, shops and restaurants, and plenty of activities are on the schedule. Just because it's cold doesn't mean there's not plenty to do. Winter Days runs through Saturday. Temperatures below zero this morning, warming up to about 9 by noon. Increasing clouds this afternoon, high today of 16 degrees. I don't know about you guys, I'm going to be singing Meat Loaf songs <laughs> all day long. So yeah, sad to remember to about Absolutely. his passing, but I, I agree that record, Bad Out of Hell, one of the best albums of all time. Yeah. Um, we want to thank you for sharing your morning with us. We will continue to let you know about school information. It's scrolling at the bottom of your screen now, but you can find the latest information on our website, news8000.com. And we will, of course, have the latest information on our top stories of the day on News 8 Now at noon. Have a great day and weekend, and we will see you right back here on Monday.